pretty much I make videos and I post them on social media, but um, there is a, a lot of names for it, such as YouTuber, a Facebooker, an Instagrammer, online entertainer, and a social media influencer. But I personally like to go with the name of just a, a video creator. So that's pretty much what I do. That was always my goal to do TV and film yeah. and online was my only just the only thing I had so I said I'm gonna make sure that I am the most consistent at this and no one else was doing it at the time mm -hmm. so I was like this is a lane that no one is doing here in the UK because the Americans are way ahead mm -hmm. and I just said I'm gonna go for it and eventually something has to give we wanted to make this social experiment about um what women go through on a daily basis um, and the kind of harassment they get from some kind of guys on a daily basis and um, it took us a week to make this video and I remember we, we uploaded the video Friday 8 p.m. at night we weren't even sure about the timing but we just like let's post it it was me and my friend and then we woke up to 20 million views on Facebook Family Lamb is basically what I was doing online yeah. on television and, and, and I've been blessed to be able to write on it, which they didn't have to do. Clout to me is, you know, it's being able to make a change in somebody else's life. It's being able to affect someone when you have the power, when you have the influence. Unfortunately, these days, um, people take clout as being famous, have the money, have girls around, have um, pretty much that's clout to them. Have nice cars, have a nice house, show off. There's a big difference in, in industry clout and online clout. So online clout kind of has a ceiling. So you can do everything under the sun that is like influencer based. Mm -hmm. But when you're on TV, it's like, and I've, I've written on the show that, um, that I'm in, so your people want you to come around their shows. There's mm -hmm. private member clubs that will give you free membership. People will send you stuff. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's not like, for example, if you do it from like an industry perspective, you're signing something. When you do it as an influencer, it's just, thank you Adidas for this. And you don't know when you're going to get it again. Mm -hmm. You get it as opposed to here. They're like, when you want something call this number and, um, it's just different. It's just different. I mean, I don't like to, to to physically show you, but you can't use your online clout on this side, but you can use this side on that side. I was around 18, 19 years old. I was in college. Um, I wasn't liking the college that much. Um, I wasn't getting the best grades, so I was just one day a bit of the depression going on in my my. I was on YouTube and this video pops up and I watch it and I enjoy it and I, I kind of thought that I can be doing this and um, I have already do it anyway on a daily basis basically and might as well just film it. So I filmed one uh, on campus and it was like a little prank that I did on like some students. Almost got kicked out of college so I figured maybe school or college is not the best place to film but that's pretty much that's pretty much how I started. I, I had a really crap childhood. Um, I, was, I, was, I was born in Ivory Coast, so I uh, came here when I was seven. I lived with my stepmom, which didn't go too well. Um, as I got older, I just fell more and more apart from my parents. They eventually kicked me out. It was just, it's a roller coaster of stuff. And Tommy Expensive was my. That was my outlet. So when people were seeing videos of the dad character I was creating, they think I was just making it up. But that was just what my dad was doing to me. I think cloud is positive if you use it in a positive way. If you if you use your cloud in a way that you can affect people's lives. If you have relevancy, basically what cloud is relevancy, relevancy and fame and a bit of money, whatever, something that gives you this power to change. That could be changed for the better or changed for the worse. So um, 
If you use your power, if you use your clout in the right way to change lives, to affect lives of these people who are watching you on a daily basis every single day, um, that's using the clout in a positive way.